Hi guys, Steph here. What we're going to do today is show you a lovely pen that was kindly sent to me from the people at Marte Modena Luxury Goods. They sent me this pen to review, which is what I'm going to do. So let's go ahead and do it. What we've got here is a Marte Modena Citizen range. And this particular model is the London, which we'll show you in a moment. It comes in this outer case with the company details on the back. Um, let's take the outer case off. Inside what you'll find is the Citizen um, instructions and some information about the pen. You've got the warranty and of course the dealer stamp date etc of the model. And the beautiful thing about this, this particular range of pens, the Citizens, is that they provide you with a two year warranty, which I think is very good for a pen. Um, inside the pen comes in this sort of leatherette spring loaded case with this lovely stitching um, to the edge. And if we take the pen out, close the uh, spring loaded case, and this is the pen. As I said, this is the Martin Medina Citizen London. Now, as you can obviously see, it's got blue, white and red, which represents the, the flag of the Union Jack. The Citizen range, they come in numerous different colours and they represent numerous different large cities of the world. Uh, to include the likes of uh, Madrid, Moscow, Mumbai, Beijing, um, Tokyo, New York and I believe they're also lucky to make other um, different colours for other major cities as well. But as I say this one is the London and it comes in this blue, white and red. Now the nice thing about these pens, they're actually all handmade and they're made in what they term as a special resin which is, um, it's actually hand turned from a solid bar. Now this resin, although you can't see it from the sort of the red section, but the white section and especially this blue has this lovely sort of pearlescent shimmer to it. Again, it's also on this white in in sort of normal light you can actually see it's got this lovely lovely sort of shimmer and you can see it there quite quite clearly on the blue um, the pen there comes with this you can see it's got this quite a standard clip to the top of the cap there which is gold plated and if I bring it a little bit closer there you'll notice it's been laser etched with the name Marty Modena to the bottom of the cap You'll see it's, it's not so much as a cap band, it's, I think it's been engraved into the cap. It's got this lovely sort of Greek stylized band around the bottom of the cap there. And if we take you to the top there, you've got once again this lovely gold button or cap uh, top of the cap there, which again has the Martin Medina logo to the top. All in all, a lovely pen, a lovely sized pen. I personally like larger pens. And this one, size-wise, suits me fine. The size of the pen from the top of the cap to the bottom of the barrel, uh, the length is approximately 14.3 centimetres. The width is a lovely 1.6 centimetres. And the weight is a very nice 23 grams. So it's not a small pen. Um, it's, well, yeah, I would say it's sort of medium to large pen very nice to hold and a lovely weight to it now these pens um although this one came to me from marty medina which will leave you the um the details later on they're actually made by a company called marlin from italy and as i say these pens are all handmade the the clip the metal pieces are all handmade and again it's all hand turned from well, as, as we say, this special resin. So the lovely pens. Let's undo the cap like so. Let's show you the pen in different angles. Okay. Very nice indeed and a lovely size as well. Now, if we take you up to the section there, you can see it's got this slight concave section there. Just below you can see the, uh, the red section there is where the cap actually screws on it's the thread and then a lovely touch which is quite reminiscent to a lot of my 
uh, vintage pens you can see it's got this ink view window just below the thread there so you can see when you're running out of ink or when you're filling the pen up if we take you up to the to the nib quite a standard plain nib with again laser etched Martin Medina logo to the nib there these nibs for these pens are actually made by well they're actually made by Peter Bock from Germany who are a, well basically they're a very renowned company that make quality nibs in stainless steel gold play platinum gold etc etc so they're a Peter Bock nib a very renowned nib maker from Germany the nib on this pen is a size 6 you can see the feed underneath has got this what I like to term as a comb feed underneath so all in all very nice this one I believe to be a gold plated nib um, all the pens when they when they come they come with a medium nib although I do believe that other nibs may be available at fine broad you know whatever size you actually prefer again lovely and comfortable to hold this concave sort of uh, section there is very comfortable to hold now one of the other things I actually like about this pen is actually the way it fills you can see to the bottom there we can actually unscrew the end cap there like a blind cap off a vintage pen and what you have is a is a piston filler now if I actually turn the piston there if you keep an eye on the window there you'll see the piston going all the way up there and if I take it all the way back again you'll see that the piston retracts back into into the barrel these pens I believe well the, the they've got this is a piston filler I believe a converter and they'll also ex, um, accept cartridges so but personally I do actually like this this piston filling system there we go so what I'll do actually let's test the pen it'll be interesting to see how the pen writes so let's bring on some ink so what I'm going to do I'm going to leave it like this so we can see what's what's happening let's uh, dip the nib in the ink let's turn the piston I'm hoping you can actually see that turn the piston so it goes down we can hear sort of lots of bubbling going on which is precisely what we want to hear there you go now what I'm going to do I'm going to just put a little bit of ink in we don't want to put well we don't want to put too much just for a writing sample let's give the uh, section a wipe so there you go we've got a little bit of ink there enough for a, a writing sample let's uh, pop the barrel back on and the nice thing about it is obviously you know you don't really need to take the barrel off to fill the pen but just to show you how everything works let's put the the blind cap back on and let's bring on some paper so let's see how the pen how the pen writes so let's just give it there we go a test everything's coming through fine so what we have for you is this is a city citizen pen and this this one as we've said before is the the London edition although as we mentioned you've got lots of other cities you can actually buy so depending where you're actually from again it's writing with a medium nib or a medium line and it's writing nicely it's writing with a lovely smooth smooth line so let's uh, there you go there doesn't appear to be any skipping or anything so let's show you a writing sample as you can see writing with a medium line lovely and smooth so a lovely nib as you would expect from from the Peter Bock company so that's the writing sample there so there we have it that's the <coughs> Marty Modena Citizen this is the London edition incidentally you can buy these pens from Marty Medina and the price of them I think is very respectable as well they're actually priced at 99 euros which 
in sort of our English pounds is around about £85. So I think that is quite a good price for these pens. As I say, that you can see the quality made pens to feel, they're a lovely weight, they're a lovely size as well. So at £85 I think is very good. Also don't forget, you get the two years manufacturer's warranty with the pens. So again, I believe that's to be, well, and a superb deal. So a lovely pen, as I say, this one comes to me from Martin Medina. They're made by a company called Marlin in Italy. And again, they're all handmade from this special, special resin, which as I said before, has this lovely shimmer to it. So I hope you've enjoyed looking at this pen as much as I've enjoyed showing it to you and sort of reviewing it and testing it. If you want to have a look at their site, Marty Medina, there's the web page. Go and have a look. They sell lots of other pens as well. Um, and as I say, you can see this pen there. So go and have a look. But for the time being, I hope you've enjoyed looking at the pen as much as I enjoy showing them to you. And just for this instant, don't forget, leave a comment. Tell me what you think of this pen. And I'm sure Martin Medina would be interested as well. So leave a comment below. But for now, I'll just say bye-bye for now.